Bharati Public School online classes. I hope you all are fine. My name is Vimi and I will be taking your computer subject. As in the previous video, we discussed about first generation of computers. In continuation to that topic, we will further discuss about other generation of computers. Now, let's begin. Today, we are discussing other generation of computers. Let's begin with the web chart. See in the web chart, there are five generations. First generation, second generation, third generation, fourth generation and fifth generation. In web chart, it's mentioned here which technology was used in these generations. In first generation, vacuum tubes in second generation transistors were used in third generation integrated circuits in fourth generation vlsi and in fifth generation artificial intelligence let's begin with second generation second generation computers were developed in 1956 to 64 which technology was used in this generation? Transistors. Transistors were used in this generation. Comparatively smaller in size with less processing time. It means it was taking less time to process the data. Input was given by punch cards and output was obtained by line printers. Let's understand with some more features of second generation computers. It was faster and less expensive than first generation. Let's see in the picture how it was. Now move to the next slide. Third generation computers. Third generation computers were developed in 1964 to 71. Which technology was used in this generation? Integrated chips or integrated circuits. Smaller, reliable and efficient. Input was given by keyboard and mouse. In this generation, output was displayed by monitor. See in the picture how third generation computer was. Let's understand about 4th generation computers. 4th generation computers were developed in 1971 to 80. Which technology was used in 4th generation computer? VLSI. VLSI means very large scale integrated circuits were used in 4th generation computer. It's like a CPU. Like CPU is used to process the data, so it was doing same work. Faster, reliable, accurate and portable. Portable means we can put from one place to other place. Let's understand about 5th generation computers. 5th generation computers were developed in 1980 onwards. It means which computers we are using nowadays like laptop, LCD, LED. You can see in picture also these came in 5th generation. Let's see the features. It is based on artificial intelligence. Next feature is able to learn from their interactions with surrounding. It means when we are communicating with someone like I am communicating with you in class. Which topic I am explaining you in class? You are understanding. Now, let's understand characteristics of computers. All of you know what is computer. A computer is an electronic machine which takes input from the user, process it and gives the output. It has certain characteristics that enable it to perform all the functions correctly. Let's understand the advantages of computer. First is speed. It means 
इट कैन डू द वर्क वेरी फास्ट सेकेंड इज एक्यूरेसी अ कंप्यूटर फंक्शन विद अ हाई डिग्री ऑफ एक्यूरेसी मीन्स इट कैन प्रोवाइड एक्यूरेट रिजल्ट इन लेस टाइम थर्ड इज परसिस्टेंस अ कंप्यूटर डजेंट गेट टायर्ड इट कैन डू वर्क फॉर लॉन्ग आर्स फोर्थ इज स्टोरेज कैपेसिटी इट मीन्स इट कैन स्टोर लार्ज अमाउंट ऑफ डाटा नाउ लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड लिमिटेशन ऑफ कंप्यूटर सी अ कंप्यूटर कैन नॉट थिंक ऑन इट्स ऑन इट मीन्स अ कंप्यूटर कैन नॉट थिंक लाइक ह्यूमन्स कैन इट कैन नॉट डेवलप आइडियाज नॉर हैव ओपिनियंस ऑन एनी टॉपिक सेकेंड इज कैन नॉट मेक डिसीजन्स ऑन इट्स ऑन इट मीन्स इट डजन हैव द एबिलिटी टू टेक डिसीजन्स नेक्स्ट इज नो क्रिएटिविटी बिकॉज द क्रिएटिव आउटपुट इज ऑलवेज रिजल्ट ऑफ इनपुट्स विच आर प्रोवाइडेड बाय द ह्यूमन्स टूडे आई हैव फिनिश द चैप्टर वन इवोल्यूशन ऑफ कंप्यूटर्स एंड नेक्स्ट चैप्टर वी विल स्टार्ट इन नेक्स्ट वीडियो बाय द टाइम कीप लर्निंग थैंक यू